Neurofibromatosis is a complex disorder, rarely heard of, yet one child in 3,000 is born with the condition. NF can cause tumors to develop on nerves anywhere in the nervous system, including the brain and spinal cord. The complications of neurofibromatosis can be life-changing and devastating. When you have a child, you just automatically sometimes assume that everything is going to be okay. And then when with him, the first year of his life, we didn't even know he had it. So he got diagnosed at around about a year of age. Mm -hmm. And uh, because we noticed that his eye was kind of drooping and originally we thought it was a sty. So, but then when he got his diagnosis, there was a lot of emotions that that entered. Um, he just wondered so much because when they told us he had NF or when he got his diagnosis or even the possibility of him having it, we just went home and, and hit Google. And um, well, you see a lot of images of different kinds of things and you get scared. And so I think the biggest difficulty was that for us, like being able to cope emotionally. Not knowing what's going to happen, how mild, how severe it is, just the unknown is hard to deal with cancer, complete hearing or vision loss, severe abnormal bone growth, balance issues, disfigurement, intense pain, and memory and learning difficulties are only some of the many challenges which can affect individuals with NF. I think it's also important to stress to people that yes, it happens as a genetic disorder, but it also can happen as spontaneous mutation. Just because it's not in your family doesn't mean that it's going to come to your family and that's, that's why awareness and knowledge is, is very important because it could happen to anybody. That's the hard part, being helpless as a parent. Having a child that's in pain, you can't do anything to help them. Parents live with it day to day. That's one of the hardest things, having them treat your child like you never know how they're going to treat her. And that's why we would like to educate not only people out there, but hospital personnel, doctors, nurses, interns. help spread awareness of this common but rarely heard of disorder. Continue the conversation about neurofibromatosis. We're ordinary everyday people that are just trying to live our life like everybody else does. And we all want to be happy, we all want to be loved and, and accepted in society.